Hello guys, today I will be doing a video of my Deal Extreme Knife Collection. Um, so this is the box where I keep my knives. This is actually a box I got um, with a laptop cooling pad. Um, basically a big uh, cooling pad which has ice crystals inside which will melt and cool your laptop when there is heat. So yeah, um, this is the box I got from it and I use it to keep my knives. So. Um, the first knife I'm going to show you is actually a multi-tool knife. Um, this is from Dead Extreme also. You guys can um, check out the link to um, this. Um, the link to all the knives will be down below in the video description if you guys are interested to check it out. So this is the again the Swiss Tech Alti Key right here. As you guys can see, it says Swiss Tech Alti Key. Um, it is. From the extreme, the link will be below. I'm not going to open up the knife because it's a bit hard to open. But there is this um, screwdriver, this knife, this serrated knife blade. Um, behind there's this uh, the flat screwdriver and stuff. So yeah, um, let me show you guys my knives. Um, the first knife I have, this is one of my first knife from the extreme. I did not do an unboxing of this, but yeah. This is one of my first knives, Smith and Wesson. If there's the link to this, I'll try to link it below. I'm not sure if it is still available, but yeah, I'll try to link it below. As you guys can see, Smith and Wesson, um, very very nice build quality, full metal construction, and looks very very nice. Um, yeah, <laughs> the overall looks very very nice. So yeah, on the back, lots of screws. So it looks very cool. Um, the next knife we have right here is this. Comes in a pouch. Um, this Columbia knife. There's a dragon uh, uh, carving on it. So yeah, very nice knife. Again, very nice design. Um, full metal construction is pretty sharp and to lock unlock it to keep it you just press it down and fold it back very very nice looks like a spearhead if you guys watch my unboxing video so yeah second knife I'll try to put it right here so you guys can see it next knife right here we have is this um, knife um, I'll also link it below Another Smith and Wesson knockoff. So yeah, just a knife like this, pretty sharp also. Um, and there's a whistle right here. You blow into it, there's a whistle. So, so yeah, that's the whistle. Then another knife. So, let me, um, let's see what else we have. We have this little small little mini knife to open. Very very easy. Just open it up like so. To lock it. Press it down lock it and yeah very nice so um, looks very slick and nice so uh, another Colombian knife and there's a dragon uh, carving or etching right here also so yeah close it close it press this and sorry I <laughs> I'm not used to this knife in very long, so to close it, you just press this down and it will close. So yeah, um, the next knife we have, oh this is actually a multi-tool, the knife is somewhere here, if I'm not wrong. So this is it, this is the knife. So yeah, and there's pliers and stuff, there's a video on this, if you guys are interested, you guys can search it up, just search DX multi-tool and it will come up. And next we have this pen knife from DX and this is a very very sharp one of the sharpest knife I've had from DX Extreme so very nice so um, next up we have this oh this is one of my latest knife and one of my favorite um, because when you press this it automatically flips out and it's very easy to open oh uh, let me show you guys that again I don't think you guys can see it like this very very nice and it's pretty small and I like it it's small nice compact sharp and yeah the color of it is also pretty damn nice so there's a glass breaker on the back very nice I like it a lot and to close it press it down close it 
Um, more knives. Um, this one. Um, also, last time used to be one of my favorite. Um, to open it up, you have to um, press this little uh, knot right here and push it out. And yeah, very. This is also very very sharp. One of the sharpest knife from DX. Also, this is one of my top five knives from DX.com. You guys are, if you guys are interested you guys can check out the link the link will be down below so yeah again if you guys watched my top five nice video this is I believe one of it um, this is also one of it um, this is uh, maybe one of it I forgot so yeah <laughs> so there you go to close it to close it you press this up and close it so put it in the pouch um, put it here just the camera angle a bit. So let's see. Next up, we have this mini knife from DX.com. Boker Plus. It says right there. Uh, obviously, a fake poker. If you guys are interested, you guys can check it out. Again, the link will be below. To close it. You press this down and close it. Very nice. And let me see. This one is just a cheap ass multi tool I got from my local store. No use. And yeah, my last knife right here. A uh, bit of carbon steel. This is uh, another knockoff. Um, Boca Plus Tanto Edge. Very very nice Tanto Edge. As you guys can see, it's a straight edge like this. This is called Tanto Edge Boca. Um, serrated knife uh, blade. Glass breaker, seat belt cutter. Very very nice knife. So, yeah. If you guys are interested, you guys can check this out. The link will be below again. To close this knife, uh, by the way, this knife is very nice. As you guys can see, there's some texture to it. If you guys are able to see it, sorry for the lack of macro on this camera. But yeah, as you guys can see, there's some texture to it. Very, very nice. So, if you guys are interested, the link will be down below uh, for you guys to check it out. And yeah. So, that's it, guys, for my last knife. So, to close it, you. Press it down and close it. So yeah, there you go. So that's it for my knife collection from the extreme. There's a total of one, two, three, four. Again, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven knives from DX.com. All the links to all this will be below. I'll try to find it and link it below if you guys are interested. I'll see you guys in my next video, and I hope you guys have a nice day. Bye bye.